Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning. Today is Commonwealth Day. And what I want to do first is read out a statement from the Right Honourable Patricia Scotland QC, the Secretary General of the Commonwealth of Nations. Fly a flag for the Commonwealth provides a splendid opportunity every year for people of all walks of life to join with others in their local community to celebrate Commonwealth Day in association with fellow citizens throughout our worldwide family. People from nations and territories in every continent and ocean cherish the rich diversity of our membership the deep sense of affinity and kinship we share, and the Commonwealth values and principles that unite us. Together we number almost 2.5 billion people, a third of the world's population. Each one of us has something very special to offer, and as Commonwealth citizens we gain and draw benefit from vast interconnected networks of mutual support. By working together in practical ways in our local communities and by interacting and cooperating across national boundaries, we build and sustain a more strongly connected Commonwealth that is mutually respectful, resilient, peaceful and prosperous and that cherishes equality of opportunity and inclusiveness. As a symbol of how the Commonwealth links richly diverse communities around the world in a spirit of peace, respect and understanding, the Queen's Baton today starts its long journey from Buckingham Palace, taking a message of hope to all who will next year compete in or watch the wonderful spectacle of endeavour and achievement, the Commonwealth Games in Gold Coast, Australia. This year our theme is a peace-building Commonwealth. At a time of increasing instability and uncertainty in the world, the Commonwealth Family of Nations in its rich diversity, becomes an ever more needed source of strength and hope for all our members. A peace-building Commonwealth reaffirms our Commonwealth Charter principles that international peace and security, sustainable economic growth and the rule of law are essential to the progress and prosperity of all. Fly a flag for the Commonwealth is an occasion to acknowledge publicly and collectively the continuing aspiration of the Commonwealth to build on common traditions and uphold our shared values of democracy, inclusive development and respect for diversity. Local and national flag raising ceremonies in schoolyards, on village greens, in town squares and on mountain tops and beaches bring greater understanding and appreciation of the values and principles of the Commonwealth Charter to which the governments of each of our 52 member states subscribe and to which each of us individually as Commonwealth citizens can recommit ourselves on Commonwealth Day. I send my best wishes to all involved, saluting you and wishing you well as you raise both the Commonwealth flag and awareness of all that we achieve together through Commonwealth cooperation. I will now read to you the Commonwealth affirmation. Joining together as members of one worldwide Commonwealth community and valuing the personal dignity and worth of every citizen, we raise this flag as a symbol of the ties of kinship and affinity that we cherish. We draw inspiration from our diversity and the opportunities for working together as a rich source of wisdom and a powerful influence for good in the world. We affirm our commitment to upholding the values set out in the Commonwealth Charter, to serving one another in a spirit of respect and understanding, and to advancing development, democracy and cooperation, locally, nationally and internationally. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for attending the uh, Fly the Flag for the Commonwealth today.